hi second grade it's been so long since I've seen you we've really missed you um, we're hoping that you've remembered how to regroup to add two digit numbers we added two digit numbers before this week we're going to go on to three digit numbers so that's why our learning target has changed to I can regroup to add two and three digit numbers so let's review really quickly over here I have this problem on the board 42 plus 59 we always start with the ones 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 so 9 plus 2 I'm going to just add 9 10 11 <coughs> Now we know when it's 10 and above, we have to give it a shove over to our tens column. So I can't write my entire number 11 here. I'm just gonna write my ones here, my tens here. So now I have to add my tens column. I add all three numbers, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Since I have nothing over here in this column in the hundreds, I can write my entire number 10 here. So 42 plus 59 equals 101. Okay, so now we're gonna move over to a three digit plus a three digit problem. So I have this problem on the board, 376 plus 584. And I don't want you guys to get freaked out here. I want you to think, we always start with the ones column. So I just want you to focus on the ones column and then it becomes really simple. We know how to add six plus four in the ones column. So we're just gonna do that first. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, if it's over 10, I'm gonna to have to move it over to the next column. So I'm gonna write my ones here. My 10 or my one, my one 10 is gonna get moved over to this blank space right up here. So I'm gonna put my one here. So I, do you see how I moved it to the next column over? Then I just add the next column. So just focus on this column right here, the tens column. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Don't forget about this one. 16, 10 and above. I have to move it over to the next column again. So my 6 goes here. My 1 goes here. Then I add the hundreds. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. There's my answer, 960. So don't let the big numbers fool you. You just have to remember what we've learned so far. Remember that it's just like adding a two digit number and you just take it column by column. Start with the ones, move to the tens, and then go to the hundreds.